The results are in. The latest 40 Days for Life campaign has saved nearly 500 unborn lives from around the globe this Lenten season. Praise be to God. And these saves happen because pro-lifers show up on the sidewalks. We got a close-up look at 40 Days in Action for this week's Pro-Life Focus. Maria, Ave, Ave. Location is everything which is why the sidewalk surrounding this rundown building is prime real estate for this group of pro-lifers. As people of faith, we have a strong faith community here in Maryland. We're called to point out evil and to share the charity, the love in our hearts. Tom Trunk is the campaign coordinator for 40 Days for Life in College Park, Maryland. The group has been faithfully praying here about a decade because this building is only uglier on the inside. Behind us is an abortion facility that's been in existence for 30 years. 40 days reinforces to the community the evil that abortion is. The community-based campaign 40 Days for Life is aimed at ending abortion through prayer and fasting, constant vigil, and outreach. With chapters in over 700 cities and nearly 50 countries, the Christian campaign sees results with nearly 15,000 unborn lives saved, some of them right here. Very friendly lady stopped and came down to us as we were praying the rosary, and she said, I never want to see you stop this. I want to thank you. She said, my name is Veronica. Don't you know that last spring when you were out here praying, I tried, I came, I had the doubt in my heart, and I was abortion-minded, but I couldn't because there were people praying here at the sidewalk. There are over 100 save stories at this clinic, including one time when the group handed a pregnant mother information on fetal development. They gave this woman going in this literature, and she was in there, and she, she started to read it, and she said, no, it's not true. My baby's heart is, hasn't been beating since day 19, and it, it really it, uh, pricked her conscience. The woman's credit card wound up not working at the abortion clinic, and she left. She, this girl, Joy, saw my white hair and comes walking to me crying, and it falls into my arms crying. Her baby's going to be a year April 7th. And another time, there was a woman that was sitting over there in the gas station watching us for a long, 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 long time. And, and then finally she came over and she introduced herself and she said that, that she was watching us and not going to have uh, the abortion. We're the sunshine on the sidewalk. Everything we can offer them from parenting, support and adoption is always going to be better than coming into this place here. 40 Days for Life doesn't keep vigil outside abortion clinics to scorn women. They are there to help them. And as first-hand witnesses of lives transformed, members here say it's important for pro-lifers to simply show up on the sidewalk. When we go to mass and frequent confession and we pray to end abortion, it's important to know that we can help by coming out to your local facility and offering four hours a month. Our presence here has demonstrated to these women that we care and that we love them and that we know we're knowledgeable about the solutions that are offered to pull them away from this clinic. It really is a matter of us just being out here and offering all the abundant options instead of coming into a place like this. There were three saves within two hours, three babies saves, saved that we knew of. And this one person afterwards, he just, I mean, he, he came up and, and he also wrote about it later. And he just said, I was so sad. And I was like, why are you sad? There were three saves that day, you know, which is not always are there, you know, any known saves. Um, but he just said, because it was so easy, all it took was people being there praying. Don't feel pressured that there's any type of requirement to pray a script prayer. The prayer that's in your heart is the prayer that the Lord is wanting to hear us pray. To be sunshine on the sidewalk, it's important to show up because you never know who will be watching. To find out more about 40 Days for Life, go to 40, that's 40, daysforlife.com.